It has started. What a shame. What a disgrace. Buhari's administration is going out on the heights, on a high note of shame, reproach, and disgrace because we dare to choose a man who has no iota of concern for his people or any form to make Nigeria a better place. As we speak today, serious protests. NSA NLC fulfill promises. Protest again against fuel hike, ASU strike, bad governance. And I don't understand what they will not tell us in manifesto that um, Nigerians will believe. Okay? Especially those who have made up their mind that certain people, even though they may not meet the criteria or may, may not be leadership quality personalities, have made up their mind that they will come on board and they will vote for them. If you look at it very well, go very well to the bottom of it all and see for yourself. The truth is greed, greed, greed. Okay, it's because they have the, they know what they will get. So it's about me rather than about the generality of Nigerians. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Thank you. Breaking news: NLC fulfills promises. Protest against fuel hike. ASU strike, bad governance. Nigerian Labour Congress, NLC, has begun the two-day rally it has planned to hold in protest of the ongoing ASU strike and other promises, another problem plunging the nation dive into evil. In solidarity with the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU and other affected union, the Congress has joined the widespread protest against the ongoing strike in Nigeria public universities. The national president of the NLC, Comrade Ayebo, informed colleagues that the nation that the national day of protest were in support of union in Nigeria public universities who are fighting for high quality education in a secular sense sent to state councils for the NLC by the National Secretary and obtained by the Vanguard. In line with the decision of the National Executive Council, NEC, meeting of the Nigerian Labour Congress held on the 30th of June 2022, we have scheduled as follows the National Day of Protest to get our children back to school and support our union in Nigeria public university fighting for quality education. It's sad that they cannot see why these people want quality education for our children, but they send their own to where there is the best of education going on. You are requested to immediately converge the convey the meeting of your SAT to decide and to disseminate this information and to fully mobilize workers in your state for every important pro protest for good governance, Comrade Wabu said in the secular jointly signed by the NLC General Secretary, Comrade Emmanuel. In line with the agreement, members of the, con of the Congress on Tuesday stormed the streets of Lagos with placards emphasizing with different inscription. Some of the inscriptions are Nigeria at 60, independence, more hunger in the land, more devastation than you can ever imagine. What kind of a nation is this? So my wonderful people, this is what is happening. Yes, we have a nation where the, the, the desire, the will of the people has totally been eradicated by those who call themselves government. Buhari's administration has failed in no small way. And this man does not care. He does not sincerely, really, truly, in any way, possibly care. He just looks out for things that are beneficial to him. What happened to the other people, he can't be bothered. And it's sad. It's very sad. Because his, two, his children go to a place that people like him, Okay, we're in position ensured that the educational system in those schools, in those countries are well. And, and I tell you, this, the educational system their children went to in those countries are not, are not private universities. Any university, they are not private universities. You pay 
Okay, so it's not private university. Everybody pays. Even students in those countries, they pay because you, you know, you get a loan, student loan to pay your school fees. And when you start working, they start collecting it from your salary, from your money. So everybody pays. Every single person pays. Yes, these are some of the sad and they are getting, they are getting their money. Okay, Nigeria is broke. They are getting their money. They can't be bothered. APC administration has failed Nigeria in no small way. Yet, some people, look at it, bad governance is not a propaganda. It's not somebody trying to demean or talk down on a government who is working. For yourself, be the judge. For yourself, for yourself, be the judge. For yourself, make the decision. Don't allow anybody just give you one problem. No, you, no, no. You know what is going on. So for yourself, speak out. Do you see what is happening? Can you see the devastation and all that is going around? Can you see how terrible and bad things really are? Can you see that Nigeria has turned to a place where we all, you know, we are, we are tired of the, current, of the current predicament? It is sad, but it's the reality of what is going on. Buhari does not care what happened to Nigerian students. Don't you know that they are supposed to be in school? They are supposed to be learning. They are supposed to be learning and imparting their word and making sure that, you know, they do what is absolutely right and necessary to bring about a change. But guess what? The Buhari's administration cannot be bothered. The Buhari's administration, oh no, they can't be bothered. They move around as if they have done something and yet they are destroying the very fabric of the nation. Security is zero. Everything not working. As far to education, eh? and their own stu children are graduating from some of the best. That's the most painful part. They know the worth of education. They take they, they take less than less than a percent to school abroad. What about the others? Are you not a selfish individual? Are you not such a selfish individual? Now these are some of the things that are going on and why we cannot afford. Okay, to keep quiet and be watching these people and all they do. We can't allow it. We can't allow it. So Nigerians, we've got a call duty, every single one of us. We've got that responsibility to ensure that we all speak out against this administration with the wickedness being implemented on Nigerians. We must speak out against it. It's not one person trying to propagate a scandal. No, no, no. It's not working. It's not working. It's not. It's not working. So leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Bye for now.